Hi everyone and welcome to RevMax.com. Today I want to do a brief demonstration on how to get started making money with mobile affiliate marketing. Today I want to demonstrate and get the point across that anyone out there watching this video wanting to make money online can make money with mobile without any experience. You don't have to be a coder, you don't have to be a designer, you don't have to know all these skills to get into mobile affiliate marketing and start making money. Mobile affiliate marketing is a huge buzzword right now because if you're familiar with affiliate marketing then you kind of understand about how much money can be generated with very little resources, very little overhead. You don't have to have an office full of an employees. You don't have to have you don't have to have an office for the, that fact. As long as you have an internet connection and obviously a computer that works pretty good, um, you can get started making money with mobile marketing. So today I just want to talk a little bit about it and let you know how you can get started regardless of your experience level. So let's just dive right on in here. Um, some of the, some of you may know me, some may not. Um, basically, I've been doing mobile affiliate marketing since 2009. I've been working online since 1998. So I've definitely been in the game a long time. I was um, around the internet when it first really got started and started getting very popular. And um, I started my first online business in 98 when I was 14 years old. And that was with a, a professional wrestling website. And I basically sold ads on that site and started making a good bit of money. And I've had a number of different businesses since then. Well, right now on your screen, you're going to see some of my... Um, mobile revenues here over the last couple of months and this is from my mobile media buys my mobile affiliate marketing so I'm basically an affiliate and I work with merchants to um, drive conversions to their offers and so we're going to talk about um, those type of offers and we're going to talk about how um, how you make money with it so you'll notice here on my presentation you're going to notice that anywhere you go nowadays, and, and this is so true, everyone's got a mobile device. And it, it doesn't matter what their age is or even the, in the demographics or what country they're in. It, you can go to the local restaurant down the street and you're going to see people pecking on their phone, especially if you look up by the bar or maybe people by themselves. They're checking their Facebook. They're reading their news feeds. They're, um, you know, they're reading and doing stuff um, you know, constantly. When I got started making money online in the late 90s, to be on the internet, you actually had to be in front of your big old computer sitting in a in a desk somewhere because the computers back then, you know, they unless you had a laptop, which were still very big, you, you had to have room for it. You had to have a, a modem and plugged in. Well, now it goes with you in your pocket. So that's um, one big thing is it provides a whole new opportunity of a lot more people. And that's what I said here. It's provided marketers all over the world the opportunity to generate hundreds of million dollars in affiliate commission. And um, that's why I consider mobile media buying the next internet gold rush. Or I guess it's really not really the next gold rush anymore. It's here. It's been here and very heavily. My team and I have worked um, really since 2011, um, pretty much around the clock, full time running mobile offers. So take the screenshot for what it's worth. I just want to show... Um, you know what's possible. I'm not saying you're going to make this because it does take a, a heck of a lot of hard work, but it is possible to make these type of numbers with mobile. So um, just kind of keep that in there as some motivation. Let's go on to the next screen then. Okay, so the first thing is before we can talk about mobile media buying, we have to first explain affiliate marketing. Some of you watching may already know, um, but if you don't, stick around and listen. If you do know, then you might pick up something, something new here um, as well. So affiliate marketing is the uh, form of performance-based marketing. And this is where businesses or merchants um, reward affiliates that um, send customers to their, to their site to buy their products. Um, and this could be in a form of a commission of the sale. For example, um, Amazon's got an affiliate program. So if you use your Amazon affiliate link and someone buys a product from that link, you're going to make a commission. Um, well, the same goes true with um, with mobile marketing. There's mo there's clients that specifically um, just want mobile traffic and for the conversion they're going to give you a percentage of that of that and we're going to talk about that. But there's four components that, are, that make up affiliate marketing and that's the merchant also known as vendor or advertiser. Um, you know they're called different things it's kind of interchangeable but it's just important to know that there's a merchant there's there's that's the person that is going to be paying for the for the conversions. There's um, a network and that consists of offers to choose from. That's um, one of the things we do at RevMax.com is we are a network full of offers for media buyers. And then the, the other part is the publisher, and this is also known as the affiliate. So if you're watching this video, most likely that's what you are. And there's finally the customer, or the consumer, the person that's actually buying the product. 
So I've got a little diagram here. So it basically goes the affiliate and probably you watching that are learning to become a mobile affiliate. You go to a network and you get offers that they've already gotten from merchants and you promote those offers and then you make a commission. So that's kind of how it works here. I and mean, when I said you don't have to have any experience or skills, you don't because you're going to be getting the offers that you're going to be promoting from a network who's already worked with the merchant. So you don't have to go out and find merchants and explain to them what you're doing. You just simply go to the network, let them know that you're an affiliate and you're going to be generating traffic for them. And then as you start to, um, you can get these offers from them and then you'll start generating traffic to those offers. So we'll talk more about that. Let's carry on. Here's a nice little diagram I made and um, I, I apologize for the cheesiness of it. It's um, funny PowerPoint graphics here. But um, just here's kind of a visual for those of you that are, are visual learners. Um, just for example, you would be the affiliate right here, and you'd be going to the network to get the offers, which they've already gotten from the merchant. Okay, so in this example, RevMax.com, we're a media buyer network. Um, not so much an affiliate network um, like some of their traditional ones, but we are a media buyer network. We work with high volume mobile media buyers. And so you could come to us and you could get offers to promote what we've already got from the merchants. And the net, the affiliate network or network handles the payments. So when you're, you're, you want to get paid for your commissions, the network pays you. The merchant pays the network, the network pays the affiliate. So that's, that's kind of how that process works. Now, as for the affiliate, how you make money is you send, you buy traffic or you generate traffic, which we're going to talk about, not in great detail in this video, but we will talk about it in great detail. Um, you're going to generate traffic to the offers that you get from the network. You're going to generate traffic, and then once those offers or offer starts getting conversions, that's when you make money. So again, if, if one of the offers, let's just use an example of an app install. You're very familiar, if you have an iPhone or if you have an Android phone, you're very familiar with apps. Well, there's companies that develop apps and they reward affiliates for sending downloads. Um, so an example is the UC web browser that we're going to go through it in detail. Um, if you sent people through your affiliate link to download the UC web browser, then you would be paid a commission per install. So let's keep going here. Okay, so mobile versus desktop marketing. Now this is a fun thing to talk about. I got again, I got started in 1998, so I've been around when it was there was no such thing as mobile. You know, there's no such thing as a smartphone in 1998. It was all on your desktop. Well, that's changed, and you can take a look at the number of global global users, and this is in millions. And this is from Comscore. Um, that's where I got this image from. But you can see here, and this I, I took this here in, in 2015. This data concluded um, last year. But you can see this overlapping of the number of people on mobile versus desktop is finally surpassing it, um, according to Comscore. And there's other companies out there that have very similar data. But I'm confident enough to say now that there are more people on their mobile devices, on their mobile smartphones, than there is on their desktop computers on the Internet. Uh, they're looking at the internet or browsing or using the internet. So because of this, this is where there's such that huge, huge opportunity for mobile affiliates. Desktop marketing, they, and you know, back in 98, it was wide open. There wasn't a lot of affiliates. There wasn't a lot of people uh, making money on the internet. The companies that got in early are the ones that really started to make a lot quickly. And then, of course, as it grew, it got more and more saturated. But, you know, it's still there was opportunity to get in. Well, right now we're seeing that with mobile. And as you can see right here about um, in between 2013 and 2014, we get ready to cross it. Well, as soon as this crosses it here, it provides a huge opportunity for affiliate marketers to go to mobile traffic because there's so much of it. If you're if you work as an affiliate marketer, you know one of your key advantages is cheap traffic is being able to buy traffic for cheap or getting a lot of traffic for free. Um, either which way you want to go about it, the key is getting a lot of traffic. My first website back in 1998, it made money because it got very popular. And it got popular by word of mouth and type in type traffic. Nowadays, uh, you have to work a little bit harder for that traffic, but with social networks, it kind of levels out to where it can be just as easy to get that traffic. But nonetheless, even if you have to go buy traffic, you're going to find um, cheap prices with mobile because there is just there's so many people that are on mobile devices it simply can't all be sold 
Okay, so if you have a history in desktop affiliate marketing or affiliate marketing in general, if you've been an affiliate marketer um, on the web, this presentation we're not going to talk about that type of promotion. So if you're if you're an Amazon affiliate, for example, we're not going to talk about Amazon affiliate marketing. We're not going to talk about offers that convert with a credit card. And so that means like when you go to Amazon on your computer, it shows up and it looks nice. Now if you go on your phone, it formats your mobile phone. Now that's so that's a what's called a responsive website. Amazon's responsive. It works on your mobile phone it also works on your um, desktop computer the type of mobile offers we're going to be talking about are pretty much exclusively for um, mobile devices so then that's just for the purpose of this video just so we can teach mobile affiliate marketing but the difference between these two mediums is, is a lot. So I've seen a lot of people, and, and myself included, it was quite the transition moving from being just a desktop marketer to moving into mobile. Because people, again, I, like I said earlier, there's people all around the world, anywhere you go, restaurants, coffee shops, bars, malls, schools, and they're, all, and they're on their phone. And normally any play, anytime you go to one of these places, you're at any given time, one person's going to be checking something. Well, because they're not sitting down in their room like in the 90s on their on their computer browsing their mindset's a little bit different so because that difference in mindset that's why we have to um, take a different approach when we when we talk about mobile marketing if someone's in line at Starbucks they're not going to have a lot of time to become a successful conversion because they're probably scrolling through a news feed or you know trying to avoid that awkward look with the cashier as they pay their check or, or whatnot um, so the that kind of um, you'll see conversion rates of mobile especially will be better in the evening hours after 5 p.m. and wherever the country is because after 5 p.m. people are not at home or in line. I mean, they are at home. They're not in line or at work I'm in places where they don't have time. Whereas desktop marketing, if, if they were on a desktop computer, more than likely they had a lot more time than just sitting in line at Starbucks. So I put on here, trust me, I've consulted and coached and advised people who were doing very well in traditional desktop marketing only to fall flat in their face with mobile. And that's because you have to develop your mindset. You have to adapt, develop, and progress. Times are changing, so you kind of have to change your approach. And we're going to get into more of that into detail. Okay, so definitely the future is with mobile. We know that. And looking back at that graphic um, where you see mobile surpassing desktop, we, we now know that, well, there's going to be more people on their mobile devices than their desktop computers and especially as smartphones become more and more affordable around the world um, it's definitely going to be the case um, you know and, and especially with younger the younger generations now are being brought up on these um, my little nephew he he can get on a smartphone um, my stepchildren they can both get on a smartphone and, and use it to pretty much even better than me or as good as me if not um, so it's definitely that's where the future is heading so since apple the apple iphone it kind of came out it came out in 2007 and it kind of set the stage and the popularity across the globe has, has just exploded um, and again it, this kind of goes back to everything I've already said any everywhere I go if I just go down to the grocery store you know someone's walking through the aisle using their phone is to to um, tell them what they need at the store or they're also pecking away on their email text messages or endless notifications from social media so the advantage to affiliate markers is quite large since there is so much traffic out there so many people using the phones it provides um, all this opportunity where you can promote offers and you can make a lot of money doing that um, just because of the sheer volume and that's the thing about the internet is I've made a lot of money working online and it's not because I, I've had the best idea or ideas or it's not because I'm the best business guy but the internet is very scalable meaning once you find something that works whether it be a business, your own product, your own website, or anything, or anything, as as long as you're on the internet, you can skip. You're not limited to the boundaries of a town or a city. Um, you can go around. You can go around the globe, and you can get orders from everywhere. You can get conversions from every single country out there. So unlike a, um, if you have a, a traditional bricks and mortar business, let's say you have a local dry cleaners. Um, you're, all, you're limited to the customers that come to that dry cleaner store that's within maybe a 5-10 mile radius. You know, not too many people are going to drive more than, gosh, I wouldn't drive more than 2 miles for a dry cleaner. But not many people are going to drive 5-10 miles to go to a dry cleaner. They're going to simply find another one that's closer. So you're limited. Uh, the internet's you're not limited. You, you can go around the globe. So since it's scalable, that's how you, that's how you can make a lot of money with the internet. Now, the cool thing about being an affiliate and the reason why I recommend this video for all 
all the newbies out there um, that are just getting started or have never worked on the internet or done anything on the internet. Um, the good thing about being an affiliate marketer is you don't have to own anything really. Uh, there is some tools you have to get and there, there's um, you know some web hosting and we'll get to that. But for the most part, you don't have to have a building. You don't have to have a brick and mortar building. You don't have to have employees. You don't have to keep an inventory. So the, your overhead's very low. Uh, as long as you have that computer with an internet connection, and unfortunately you cannot use your um, tablet or your phone. I mean, you might be able to use your tablet a little bit, but if you really want to be successful at affiliate marketing, you need to have at least a laptop that you can um, you know, have a keyboard and a mouse so you can get stuff done in a, in a quick processor so you can load up graphics and stuff like that. Okay, so let's just keep moving here. So promoting off mobile offers, and as I said at the beginning of this video, for this video and for this demonstration on mobile affiliate marketing, I'm not talking about credit card based offers. So if you're an affiliate marketer and you do traditional desktop marketing or you've, you've done it or you may um, you know, have a history with it, we're not going to talk about the, the general offers that accept credit cards. We are going to talk about mobile only offers for the most part. And so these are going to include um, apps, app installs, downloads, music, um, it's going to include these type of categories. This is we're not talking about physical products that can be purchased because that that's a little bit of a different ball game, and we'll get to that eventually. But for the sake of learning mobile affiliate marketing, we're going to learn about offers that convert based on actions that happen on a mobile device. Okay, so there's three type of main actions, and that's a subscription, a lead generated, or an app install. And these are, um, you know, a bit new. If you if you worked on the desktop for a long time, you might be familiar with subscriptions or even lead gen. Um, but app installs would look a little bit different, obviously, um, on desktop. Um, also, it's important to note that a lot of mobile operators around the globe have a billing platform attached. Um, meaning that people can actually make purchases, they can buy content on their phone without ever having to enter a credit card. Um, so that's a really cool thing because it really allows you to scale stuff um, big time. Um, it, you know, especially if they don't have to get out a, a credit card and fill that out, which can be very tedious, and they can just purchase it um, on their device using their phone bill account. Um, that actually um, you know provides an area where you can really scale. So let's talk an example here about a subscription offer for mobile. Um, this offer here is called Benbit Mexico. Benbit's a tremendous company out of Mexico, and they offer mobile content for devices. So this could be um, their mobile content ranges from videos to games to special apps um, to all, all types of um, a content for mobile devices. Now, if you remember back in, I guess it was 2003, um, in the early 2000s, the feature phones, came out and ringtones were tremendously popular. Everyone had to have the latest and greatest ringtone. Nowadays, it's not that's not that popular, especially here in the United States. Now, internationally, it still is in some areas that are still developing. Um, but that's that's an example of mobile content. It's a piece of content for your phone that you, you have to pay for, and you can do that through um, your mobile operator. So here in Mexico, for example, um, the operators uh, Movistar and Telcel, they allow billing through their platform. So Benbit is the merchant here, and they offer this content through the Movistar and Telcel operators. And so this has a, what's called the two-click billing conversion flow, meaning that the, the user, the consumer, they don't have to enter a credit card. They can simply click through, agree to the terms and subscription, and then you're going to get a conversion. So for each user that goes through and subscribes to the service, um, the payout to the affiliate is two dollars and thirty-five cents. Now you're going to notice something with mobile marketing: the payouts aren't tremendous. You're not making a hundred dollars per sale like you would be if you were promoting some big credit card product. You're not making two hundred dollars. You're not making um, a lot of times. You're not making twenty-five dollars. Sometimes you are, but for the most part, the trans the payments um, that you make are, are are quite small. But where this is made up is when through volume. So yes, two dollars and thirty-five cents doesn't look like a lot but do that a million times in one month. Okay, now it looks a lot. Now you say, well, Ryan, is there a million users a month? Absolutely. 
Absolutely, and that screenshot I showed you earlier with the with some of my revenues, you can see these this these conversions really start to add up once you start to multiply it by hundreds of thousands of con of people that are browsing these type of offers. So you don't want to let the small payout scare you away. Um, and because of this, if you've ever tried to purchase mobile traffic in Mexico, meaning if you've ever um, bought traffic at any of the top popular display networks or social media platforms, you understand that mobile traffic can be a lot cheaper than desktop traffic because there's so much of it um, they can't sell all that inventory so the two dollars and 35 cents you get for a two-click flow um, is really actually pretty good especially when you're not asking the user to make a substantial purchase you're not asking the user to pull out a credit card they just simply have to click through okay um, so that's that's subscription offers let's go to lead generation offers um, this one here is called Want to Win um, Australia, and it pays on a single opt-in lead submit. So basically, the user will arrive at this landing page. They'll enter their first name, last name, email address, date of birth. Um, sometimes a, a merchant will ask a little bit more information. Um, this one here does not. And as soon as they submit this, you get paid $2.60. That's a pretty good deal, right? Um, so that, that's how that works. It, this merchant is just wanting the, um, the lead and then they go on to monetize it, make money from it later on. So you as the affiliate, you're paid just to send them a lead. And this can also range, and this is a, a gift card type deal here, this can range from insurance companies to um, the popular one now is solar. A lot of people, especially here in the United States, are, are wanting to put solar panels in their house for cleaner energy. So companies that provide this service will set up a form like this, where people can enter their information, their name, Ryan Gray, put my email address in, put my phone number, put my address, and that merchant um, is going to pay me for that lead, and then they're going to, in return, send that to the person, the company that puts up solar panels, and they're going to contact you and try to work out a, an arrangement. So that's how kind of lead generation works, and most of you are all familiar with lead gen because it, it we're, we take place in this, every, this takes place almost all the time nowadays even at restaurants or the grocery stores are big when they give you their little reward card and that's so they collect information about you and they know a little about your shopping habits but they also reward you to be a loyal customer so it's kind of a lead generation based deal they capture the information in hopes of further monetization same thing with mobile Okay, finally is the App Install offers. We already talked about the UC browser at the beginning of this video. Um, this is an, a very popular app in the um, App Store in Google Play. And you can see they've got an ad blocker. So basically, if you want to view websites on your Android phone, you can download the UC browser, and it works a lot faster than the default um, browser on the phone. It's got a nice ad blocker, and it's extremely quick. Um, so the merchant, the, the company that owns um, UC Browser, they pay um, $2.45 per install, and this is for India and Russia. So for, for traffic in India and Russia, you get paid $2.45 per install. They don't have to buy anything. All the user has to do is download the application through your link and open it up, and then it converts. So that's um, definitely a, a very good way to make a lot of quick money because you're just asking to install it. It's a free it's a free download for them and, um, and then you make money just by sending it to them. So obviously this is mobile traffic only for the Android operating system. Obviously if you sent someone to this with an iPhone it's not going to work. So just Android only and converts on the install. This is probably one of the most popular ways that especially websites and mobile apps are making the bulk of their money is advertisers that are buying um, banner ads and stuff to promote their apps. Because obviously, the more times the application is downloaded, um, the more popular that service is going to become, and the more ad revenue it's going to generate, or the more customers it's going to generate. And so that's why these merchants or companies or app developers are paying publishers or paying affiliates for downloads to their install. Um, and this can range anywhere. Some of them are 99 cents, some of them are even down to 15 cents. But again, since the user doesn't have to pay anything, they just have to download and run the app for you to get the credit for the install, it's not too hard. And once again, that $2.45 doesn't look like a lot, but then you multiply that by 100,000 and it looks like a whole bunch. Okay, so let's just um, let's just go back here to, to this slide and um, just and just revisit this since we know what the offers are now. Um, we can talk a little bit more about going to buy traffic for them. So once you um, get your affiliate network account, and again, that's uh, one of the purposes behind this video, is displaying we have an affiliate or media buyer network at RevMax.com. So our media buyers, you could be in a media buyer perhaps, can sign up with us, 
pull offers, get offers from us, and you can generate traffic to these offers, and again, you get paid. And we've talked about the three most popular ones, subscriptions, lead generation, and app installs. So those three type um, offers are, are going to be your most popular, and then you're going to get traffic from multiple places. And again, traffic's probably a half hour conversation on its own just to introduce you to it. So I'm not going to really go into too much details about um, buying the traffic right now. I want to talk about just how this offer works. You can buy traffic pretty much from anywhere. Obviously, Google AdWords, um, Facebook, those are the largest ones out there. But then there's a whole host of other net ad networks and stuff out there. But that's how Google and Facebook, that's how they make their billions is through their ad networks. So obviously, um, this is where media buyers will go a lot of times to buy traffic. But a lot just depends on what you're promoting and how you're doing it um, to make sure it works nicely at that source. Okay, so I think we've um, gone over a pretty nice little, br it's a brief um, presentation, but I think you should now have a pretty good idea of how to get started making money with mobile um, offers or what mobile offers are. So for the next steps, we're going to get into a lot more detail. Um, and and that's what we do at RevMax.com is we have a, a pretty um, intensive training uh, program because we feel like that as long as our affiliates, our media buyers, our publishers are well educated, that they will be able to promote products and services the right way instead of doing things the wrong way. So we feel that our coaching and training provides a much better experience for everyone in the whole process here because our affiliates are able to earn more money because they know what they're doing. Um, our merchants are better are able to get much higher quality um, customers to their products, services, to their apps, and it, it makes our process to be good along the whole way. And so that's what we do. So for the next steps here, if you don't already have an account with us at RedMax.com, I recommend going there now and um, applying. It's um, I've got another video on our YouTube channel here that explains the application process. So you might want to watch that after this video if you're a complete um, beginner. If you're not a complete beginner, if you're already promoting mobile offers, come check us out. Even if you already know exactly what you're doing, I promise our trainings are pretty daggone intense. You're going to learn something new. Um, and if you're already a marketer promoting desktop and you're looking to get into mobile, now's the perfect time. Um, we're currently accepting people at RevMax.com. We're not going to accept um, all the time. Um, we actually have um, phases we go through. So where we'll accept 10 people, um, then we won't accept any more in, um, people into, into the RevMax network until those 10 people get going. And then we'll maybe accept five. So um, and as long as we're accepting, you definitely want to, um, to kind of take that plunge and get it. Uh, it's free to join the RevMax.com network. There's no cost to you. You. Uh, the only cost is is willing to put in the hard work and watch our video training tutorials, um, read our guides, um, and, and understand what you're doing and get working with us. That's the only cost involved in there is time and effort. If you have any other questions, feel free to let us know. Let me know. You can you can comment below this video or you can reach out to us once you get signed up at RevMax.com. But this is Ryan Gray. This is a brief introductory video to mobile affiliate marketing. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you gained something from it. Um, and again, if you need something or if I can be clearer on something, please feel free to um, reach out and let us know. Thanks a bunch.